If you've been trying to do affirmations to help you lose the dream, there's probably kind of one mistake that you're probably making, and that is that you're not doing them in the present tense. So when you do an affirmation, when you say an affirmation, I, sh I should say, it needs to be in the present tense. You need to say, I can lucid dream. I am lucid dreaming instead of I will lucid dream uh, because your subconscious mind, which is really what you're speaking to when you, when you say an affirmation, it only understands things in the present moment. And that's why you really need to be speaking or writing in the present tense. So some examples would be things like I am lucid dreaming. I control my dreams. I remember all of my dreams every night. Instead of things like, I will remember my dreams, you need to say in the present tense. Another thing is that you're not getting, you're probably not getting em enough emotion involved when you make, say these affirmations. I don't just mean in the, in the way you say them. What I mean is in the, in the feelings you have. So when you, when you think about the affirmation, let's say if it's, I remember all of my dreams really get emotional about that and kind of thank yourself for the ability you have to remember all of your dreams. Tell yourself you're grateful for the fact that you can remember every detail of all of your dreams. And then by getting the emotions involved, you'll make it more likely to come true. Another big mistake is that you're probably not repeating these affirmations enough. So for an affirmation to work, you really, it's kind of like you're brainwashing yourself. And the best brainwashing happens when you repeatedly say or, or consume a message again and again from many different places. It's not enough to just to write it down in a journal or just to repeat it before you go to bed. You need to be happy. This message needs to be everywhere. It needs to be your password. It needs to be on your phone lock screen. It needs to be written in different fonts, in different colors, in different ways and formats. It needs to be on your fridge. Everywhere you can possibly put this message, that's where it needs to be. And that's how you're gonna get this to actually work. That's how the affirmations will actually enter your subconscious mind and become a belief then that will then become the reality you experience in the form of like whatever it is, you know, being able to remember your dreams, having lucid dreams, being able to shift, uh, being able to manifest things and being able to change your vibration or energy. So yeah, to summarize, you need to have affirmations in present tense for them to really work. They need to be really strong, emotional, and you need to connect with them. They need to be in your own words. You can't just copy someone else's affirmation and then use that as your own. You need to say it how you would say it. And then they also need to be repeated a lot. And also in you need to get them in many, many different formats. So yeah, what's your best affirmation? You can let me know in the comments section and I'll see you next time.